All right, so the first goal. How, how big of an opening did you actually have there? It looked, looked like you had any angle at all. Uh, I'm going to be honest, I didn't even look at the net. I just fired it. Flanny put it on my stick, and that's uh, uh, one of my favorite shots shooting from the back door, so I just uh, I, I had faith, and I just fired it at the net. Luckily, the goal wasn't over. What, why is that your favorite uh, favorite spot to shoot from? Just because I can get open, and I can I can uh, move my body in any position I, I, I want. I get a lot of freedom there to to kind of open and move with the puck, and uh, I just let it go as fast as I can. Where do you think this offense production came from after you know a whole month and a half really of struggling? I know a couple of games ago you had six goals, but really uh, haven't scored like this all season. Um, I think it's it's been practice. Practices have been real hard, and the coaches have have definitely put an emphasis on, on games and scoring. So uh, guys are shooting the puck more, driving the net. We're creating a lot more offense in practice just just because uh, we want to win the game against the other side. Which, which goal of yours was, was the better goal in your mind? Uh, I like the second one just because it, it, uh, I like goals that, uh, that, uh, that I can hear. Uh, so that's definitely, definitely my, uh, my favorite of the night. Um, Second period, what was that like to, to play in with six goals in total combined? And you had the penalty shot in there. I mean, what was that like as a player to play in something kind of that wild? Um, it was pretty exciting. It was an exciting game. I know a uh, uh, real exciting period for the for the fans for sure. Just gonna a lot of emotion. You got to try and control it on the bench when you score, and then they get to get one back, and we get a couple more penalty shot. It's real hard just to kind of stay focused, and I think we did a good job controlling our emotions. What's this team got to do now? You got a couple weeks off for the holidays, uh, coming back here, back on the road again. What does this team got to do to build off of this, and, and how do you keep that going? I think we got to practice even harder, because the harder we practice, the better the better we seem to play. So I think if everyone goes goes home, has a good break, good rest, but still gets after it over over our eight, nine days we have off, then we come back, got a trip to UNH. I think if we keep practicing like we are even harder, get a couple guys back in the lineup, I think we can uh, win some more games.